Hi guys, it's Rachel. In this tutorial, I'll teach you how to create a hyper-realistic rainbow iris using the Color Therapy app. Coloring an iris with unconventional colors makes for a striking image. I'll show you a few simple steps to create something bedazzling like this. You can find this image by typing in eye in the search bar. Now let's start off with our colors. So in the glow palette, you'll find some really bright, vibrant colors. Now let's go under the airbrush tool, set the size to 25 and the opacity at 50. Make sure coloring inside the lines mode is set to on. And then starting in the glow palette, begin with your first color. So I'm gonna go down the row, starting with this pink, and I'll begin to make a little swath of color in the iris. Now I'll move down to the next color. So sort of a medium purple and add it in right next to it, overlapping it. And then I'll use a darker purple. Then I'll move on to an even darker purple. And then a dark blue, etc. Until you make it all the way back to the beginning and it will blend in together. Now select a basic black and under the airbrush tool, set the size to 14 now and the opacity at 80. Now you're gonna outline the inner part of the iris just around the eyeball as well as around the pupil, just a little bit too. Now select the smear tool, set the size to one and intensity at 100. Now we wanna bring and smear in those edges that we just drew with the black in towards the pupil. So I'm kind of just making little smear lines with my finger coming inwards towards the center. Just drawing it in. All the way around. And you can do the same thing with the pupil itself and bring a little bit of the black halo you just did into the color, just slightly. Now with this template itself, the pupil needs to be colored in black. So you can go ahead and do that as well while you're at it. Now we're gonna draw in some striations in the eye. So open up the palette and grab the pen tool this time. Put the size to one and opacity at 55. Now you're going to sample each color as you go. So sample this pink right here. And then with the pen tool, you're just going to draw some little striations going up and down. Then when you get to the next color, like a purple, then sample that color there and draw in those little lines. So these are just back and forth strokes that are straight and they're kind of overlapping each other a little bit. I'm almost sort of like scribbling as I go and you can let them have a little bit of space in between each striation. Go back to the smear tool with the same settings. I'm going to blend the striations into the black part of the iris. So I'm kind of just blending downward just on the edges. Now let's add a soft glare to the eye. So go to the airbrush tool, set the size to 16 and opacity at 30. Now using a white, you're going to add a nice soft glare just on the middle area of the iris where the brightest part of the color is. And I'm just curving around the pupil there on one side as well as another side here. So you have a really nice soft kind of glow. And now we're gonna add in the hard highlights. So using the airbrush again, this time we're gonna have the opacity at 100 and the size at one. And I'm gonna add a bright highlight right here, kind of curving towards the middle of the eye and just filling that in with white. So sort of a rectangular shape. Might draw another one on the other side, kind of this time I might make some of the edges a little bit jagged. And then to finish it off, you can add in those little white highlights that were there before, just for some more detail. Finish it off by coloring the rest of the face. You can also check out my other tutorial on how to color the whites of the eyes. If you'd like to see more tutorials like this, don't forget to subscribe to the Color Therapy YouTube channel so you don't miss any new tutorial videos. Thanks for watching our tutorial. You can get the Color Therapy app for free on the App Store.